Good afternoon. Welcome to SEMTI um, 2017. My name is Mark Hall, Business Development Manager for Corsair Solutions. One of the products that we're showing this year, or a few of the products, has been pretty, pretty exciting and uh, um, had a lot of interest, is the Z-Cam range. So this is a micro four-thirds lens mount camera. Um, it has a, has a price of around about $900, um, and it will record H.264 um, high-profile 4K um, on, a, on an SD card, as well as having HDMI out. Um, there's also a, um, an app, that, like a GoPro, that connects via Bluetooth or wireless to control the camera. So it, it's very impressive for what it does. So you, you can actually see some of the shots here on YouTube, so you can go onto their site and have a look at it, but it's a, a very impressive camera with a, and a great sensor for the price. The next product that we actually have on display is called the Z-Cam S1. So this is a unit here. Now it actually has four cameras, A, B and C, mounted around, around the device. In addition to that, um, we, you'll see the four SD cards in the unit, uh, so it can actually record onto each of those SD cards. So as I said, total of 4K P25 on, on each of the cameras there. Uh, we do have a battery pack that mounts in the bottom, um, and that will click into the unit and allow you to take it and um, film on site for actually uh, up to an hour. Now if you look at the bottom of the unit, we've actually got an Ethernet out and we've also got four HDMI outputs as well. So you can actually output those HDMIs to, a, to another recording device. So let's say that we're, we're going out live streaming. So we're back to our Z-Cam controller and this is very simple and easy to do. Uh, once we've got the, we've got the camera set up as we want, so we've got the, the LUTs and the sharpness and the brightness. We can go into a tool called Wonderlife, and here we, here we have, the, have the settings and what we can do in here. So you'll see we can go up to 3840 by 1920. So um, I'll go out at that resolution. Uh, well, let's go out at um, 5 meg, but I'll actually stream to a local server just to show you a stitched live output. So I'm going out here to a Wowser server on an RTMP location, and all I have to do is literally put, put the details in there, go live, and this is actually stitching and doing a live stream. So let that just... So there we have it. That's actually a, a live stitched stream coming directly out of the Z-Cam. Now, to show you that in action, of give an example, I've got, a, I've got VLC over here on another machine, and I can actually pull that stream in. So here you go, there's that stream. So that is, that is, that's a 4K stitched live stream on there. Now as I said, I can also go straight to Facebook as well, but Facebook will allow 2K. But it's very easy to do. We did some filming, Matt, Matt's done some filming on Monday, um, and I've actually got it here, so I'll go into the tools and go on what we call Wonder Stitch. Now, as I said earlier, each of these, these ones, of each is 4K. So I can actually create a stitch preview to see what that's gonna look like. Um, and I can also specify the start frame and the end frame. So once, I, once I've got the frame start and end frame set up, I can then do my, my output resolution, what I wanna do. So I can go anywhere from 1080p right up to 6K. Uh, so, We've been doing 4K work here, but I can, I can do 6K. I specify the, the output resolution, 4K or 6K. Uh, specify the stitch engine. We use CPU and we use also GPU acceleration. I've actually got a Titan X down here doing, uh, doing processing. Um, to show you what that looks like, um, we have done a, we've done a loop. Um, so this is a loop that we did uh, of some footage. Um, all that we've done with this, we actually shot it with a Z-Log. So um, I've stitched it together, I've given it to Matt and he's basically just done some colour correction in there. But apart from that, it's pretty much, it's what you can pretty much expect out of the camera. Um, you see we've got it, here's a going through the tunnel. So there's a variety of different, different um, scenes that we, we've got. Um, one of the most impressive ones is a waterfall, um, where we've had the camera in the middle of the waterfall and you see two girls coming up to it. Now we've been showing this in through the HTC Vive and we've been showing that through the headset. So you can have that on and you're totally immersed in that experience wherever you look. So that is, as I said, 4K resolution we're running. Uh, the Vive currently accepts, I think it's about just over HD in each eye is what that can display. The, the S1 Pro is 
like this, but it basically has the four third lenses on it. So it's a same resolution, so your same 4K streaming and 6K post, but it is a lower light level. So you can see here running, here's, here's in Las Vegas. Um, and that's actually the, I'll just move around. This is, uh, this is a, stitched, a stitched image and what sort of thing you can do. This has just been uploaded to YouTube, but you'll see it's working very low light. And the next one up is the V1 Pro. Now the V1 Pro is a beast. This is basically a 7K stereoscopic H265 unit. So um, very, very impressive unit. So that we don't actually have that yet. We'll hopefully have that soon, but that, that's a bit of a brief overview. Uh, best bet is to get in touch with us at www.corsairsolutions.com.au if you've got any queries.